Hello everybody, I'm Gary Stuckey, and uh, you know I'm a huge Journey fan, right? Well, there's another huge Journey fan, and he's a chef. His name is Simon Dickinson. He's got a book out called Food Rocks, and food does rock. I love food. Love Simon, and this book rocks. He's cooked for everybody, including Journey. He's friends with Journey. He hangs out with him, talks to him all the time. Good friends with Arnell, especially in uh, Ross Valerie. It's the real life, near death tales of a true rock and roll chef and that's Simon. Look up true rock and roll chef in the dictionary. He's got his picture. Uh, Simon uh, has been cooking for celebrities, uh, rock and roll stars for for years. Uh, he's got a big list of people and different organizations. He's cooked for different events over the years. Man, Billy Idol, uh, Prince, Earth, Wind & Fire, Black Sabbath, Tina Turner, Janet Jackson. Billy Joel, Van Morrison, The Rolling Stones, Journey, of course, uh, Gloria Estefan, Metallica, Genesis. I mean, it, the list goes on and on and on. Can you see that list? It's a ton of people. And something tells me uh, if you can cook for all those people, you can cook for anybody. He's even cooked for Bill Clinton. There's a cool story in there about that. Uh, and uh, talking about The Rolling Stones, Keith Richards likes the uh, Shepherd Pies, right? Uh, what else? Uh, you know, Prince, uh, and, uh, John McEnroe playing Prince's guitar. What's all that about? <laughs> Read about it right here. Some, uh, interesting things. It had me smiling and shocked at some things, uh, that goes on behind the scenes. But, you know, it's a big duty to cook for people like the Rolling Stones. And, of course, Journey. He got a chance to hang out with Journey back in the day on tour, uh, Simon is a go-getter, and he really, when he wants something, you know, he's like, you know, he makes the best of his time. He takes the opportunity to do it. And at that time, back in the late 70s, uh, Pat Morrow, the uh, tour manager of Journey, uh, he got a chance to talk to him, and uh, he wanted to start a fan club over there. So he did. So he talked it over. Pat started the uh, official fan club for Journey in England. And then he started talking to Pat some more and got to go on the road as uh, working with him. Uh, merchandise uh, for the escape tour with Journey and eventually you know uh, cooking food for those guys and the tons of others uh, that I mentioned and those stories that uh, it's pretty amazing stuff uh, it's a very talented guy uh, smart guy Simon is uh, and so you don't want to miss it I think this would make a great Christmas gift if you're a Journey fan if you're a rock and roll fan if you're a fan of food and culinary and, and things like that. You know, uh, if you're a fan of anything like that, you don't want to miss this. Um, and people brag about Simon. Uh, there's some reviews here. Kevin Chalfant, Chalfant. You say Chalfant, I say Chalfant. Uh, he was the uh, lead singer of uh, The Storm. Remember that man? And uh, he's a big friend of Journeys. And uh, he says, when I think of Simon Dickinson, I imagine him standing in, uh, in his chef's coat in front of a full-length mirror playing air spatula. <laughs> and uh, Ross Valerie, you know, the bass player for Journey, he says, uh, Once again, this past summer, I find myself sitting at Simon Dickinson's chef's table. What a great experience. Thank you, Simon. Don't stop cooking. Uh, the book is awesome. Uh, you know, you won't... You won't be able to put it down. Uh, it says the real life near death tales of a true rock and roll chef goes backstage at some of the biggest rock extravaganzas of the past 20 years, providing a sneak peek behind the scenes of the greatest shows on earth. I mean, all those shows, all those years, preparing the food, the ups and downs, the funny stories, it's all here. Uh, get your book today. You can buy it at Walmart online. You can order. You can order uh, the uh, an ebook version uh, for just a five dollars, I think. Uh, but I think it's around twelve dollars, thirteen dollars at you know Walmart stuff like that. Uh, check it out. Uh, all you gotta do look up Simon Dickinson, Food Rocks. Uh, Google it. Buy it. Uh, you don't want to miss it. Uh, it's very entertaining, and uh, you will be happy that you bought it. Hey, I'm Gary Stuckey. Don't stop believing, everybody. God bless you.